What's going on, my New Orleans sports family? As always, I'm your boy O, and today we're talking about those New Orleans Pelicans once again. That's why, ladies and gentlemen, it won't be no Saints. As you know, the Saints is off this week, so the Pelicans is the team that we have to pay attention to. Now, I'm pretty sure that a lot of people are kind of like panicking at this moment because the Pelicans has been enduring a lot of challenges with these injuries. But trust me, things are going to get better. The only thing that we have to do at this moment, we just have to hold our heads up high because the Pelicans isn't doing bad at this moment. See, the past two seasons, it seems as if around this time, the team goes on this losing spree. I do not know why. That always seems to come to bite us in the butt at the end of the season, right? This losing streak that we always got to endure. It's almost like we got to lose 15 games in a row. But this year, I don't see that. I don't see that at all. I feel like the Pelicans can overcome that. And a lot of that have to do with Brandon Ingram. As long as they do right by Brandon Ingram, the Pelicans could achieve a lot more than what they're achieving right now. Many times when I'm watching the games, I see that we are playing and it's almost as if the ball isn't kind of reaching my man, right? It's almost like you need to score and the ball isn't reaching the guy that can score. Yeah, I know the game last night, he missed the last shot, but to me, the team isn't getting the calls like other teams as well. That'll be another video, but I feel as if late in the game, we do not play through B.I. as we should. Like, B.I. should have the ball and Zion should be underneath. Once B.I. collapsed the defense, Zion opens it up underneath, points in the paint. I feel like that's our strength. We need to get to that more often now. Right now, the Pelicans sits at 6-7, and seven, and we're ninth in the West. I mean, 6-7, and seven, that ain't bad. It's just 13 games. You got 69 left. I believe that this team will end the season with 45 plus. As long as we get ourselves healthy, we would be all right, baby. Now, right now, when it comes to the stat line, our leading scorer at this very moment is Brandon Ingram, 23.4 points a game. He needs to pick up his three-pointer, though. I would say that. We got Zion at 21.8, and we got CJ at 21.7, and Jonas at 13.6, Mr. Mr. Double-Double. We need to get McCullen back on the court. I, I swear to you, I feel like with McCullen on the court, we are a lot tougher team to defeat. You know what I mean? Like, we need to be 100%. We need Jose back. We finally got her back. That is pretty good. And excuse me if I'm all over the place. I'm not reviewing the game today. I'm just trying to talk about our team, you know, like that heart to heart. Many YouTubers, they don't like doing this, but I do because I'm a fan and you're a fan. So most of the time, it's good when fans can have a one-on-one. -on -one. I'm just talking about what I have observed regarding this team. I just feel as if once we get healthy, we will be a better team. We defeated the Nuggets the other night, and I was proud because I feel like that was a statement game. That was a game that shows that we can perform on a level of that of a championship caliber team as long as we're healthy enough. And I think that the future is bright for this team. So you guys make sure you keep up with them. They need our support. We all should show up just like we show up for the Saints. I always do myself. I show up for our home team. I got the roof for them. Got the roof for them. That's how I feel. And I'm going to continue to roof for them, regardless if they have winning seasons or losing seasons. That's just the type of fan I am. One year we're going to get our due. That's how sports works, ladies and gentlemen. And soon enough, the Pelicans are going to bring us that championship that we all crave. We want that NBA championship. All I feel like we have to do is get it. That's it. And I think that this is the team to do so. Plain and simple. Right now, we're not sucking at all. We're right in a mix of things. Not too many teams is ahead of us. Let's see here. Number one in the West is 9-3. It's Minnesota, and you're six and seven. I mean, you're only four games, you know, out of the first seed in the West. So there's a lot of basketball left to play. So you guys don't panic at all. Do not panic. Right now, this team is posed for a win streak, like a 12-game win streak. Trust me, it's coming. It's coming. The moment we get everyone back on the court, it will be an easier challenge to achieve. 
I'm your boy O. Hopefully you watched this video all the way to and help you brought that algorithm. And if you're not subscribed, please be sure to do so. I'm trying to grow this channel so I can connect with my new all in sports family. So if you love talking about the Saints, you love talking about the Pelicans, so just know we have something in common. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you are, make sure you hit that notification bell because YouTube absolutely sucks at notifying subscribers that content creators has uploaded videos to their platform. And don't forget to hit that like button. Tell me about the algorithm, people. But in the comments below, let me know how you feel about those New Orleans Pelicans at this very moment. Do you think they got the shot to go the long haul? Or do you feel like we need some work? Let me know in the comments below.